We have made it just to the east of Des Moines, Iowa on I-80, and you can see thunderstorms along the coal front now beginning to develop. We have had reports of some hailstones to the northeast of us along the coal front, and this is back building down to the south. Right now, the tornado threat appears to be quite low because we just don't have a lot of strong winds flowing into these showers and thunderstorms right now. So the main threats will be hail and high winds. But as we head into Thursday, that's when the potential for tornadoes will increase, especially south of here as you get closer to Kansas City. We are tracking an elevated supercell that is not going to be tornadic the way it looks right now. However, it is very impressive. A large hail core just to the north of us, possibly up to golf ball size. Also, you can see the lower clouds out in front of it rushing out. Those are the lower clouds with the outflow of the strong winds coming from that thunderstorm. And even the winds right here starting to pick up at our location. But it is definitely becoming well defined. A mature thunderstorm, the one that we showed you just earlier. Tracking a storm just to the south of Laurel, Iowa. Possible tennis ball size hail with this thunderstorm. Getting sporadic hail, not very large at our location, just to the south. We didn't see tennis ball size hail with our storm. However, we did get quarter size hail in Laurel, Iowa. That's east of Des Moines. Now we are behind the cold front, strong north winds and it is cooled off rapidly. But as that front heads south into a very unstable air mass, we will likely have more storms on Thursday.